Hello and welcome. Today, we will be discussing how long after someone's passing should a funeral usually take place. The timing of a funeral can vary depending on several factors, including cultural and religious considerations, legal requirements, logistical factors, and the availability of closest family and friends. Typically, funerals are held within a few days up to a week after the person's death. This gives the family enough time to make arrangements with the funeral home and contact the loved ones of the deceased. There are immediate funeral options available for those who wish to have a funeral soon after their loved one's passing. These options include direct burial, prompt cremation, and immediate family-only service. The funeral timeline can also vary depending on different cultures. For example, Christian funerals typically take place within a week of death, while Jewish funerals usually take place within 24 hours of death. Islamic funerals also take place as soon as possible, preferably within 24 hours. Hindu, Buddhist, and Chinese funerals may have different timelines depending on their specific traditions and customs. It is important to consider psychological factors when deciding how soon is too soon for a funeral. The grieving process is different for everyone, and it is important to balance personal needs with traditions. On the other hand, waiting too long for a funeral can also have its challenges. Decomposition and embalming may affect the availability of facilities, and travel limitations for family and friends may also need to be considered. In some cases, delaying the funeral may be necessary due to special circumstances. Temporary preservation techniques can be used to extend the timeline between death and the funeral. Funeral planning and coordination involves the roles and responsibilities of funeral directors, communication with family members, documentation and legal formalities, and the importance of advanced planning. Prearranged funeral services and prepaid funerals can provide peace of mind for families during a difficult time. Supporting bereaved families involves emotional and practical support, funeral etiquette, the importance of condolences, achieving meaningful farewells, customizing funeral services, incorporating loved one's wishes, and honoring cultural and religious traditions. Thank you for joining us today. We hope that this information has been helpful in understanding how long after someone's passing should a funeral usually take place. If you liked this video please subscribe and like it.